Hello guys, welcome to Korean Papsang. Today we'll be making omuk bokkum, stir-fried fishy cake. It's really easy and simple side dish that is a staple in Korean homes. I'm going to show you how to make it two ways, mild and spicy, so stay with me all the way, guys. Let's get started. Omuk is a processed seafood. They come in all different shapes and sizes. I have five sheets here that are about eight ounces. First, we're gonna blanch these in hot boiling water. This will remove the excess oil on surface and softens the fishy cake. But the water's boiling and we don't even need to continue to boil. I'm gonna turn it off. Then drop them in, oops, and just shake them around a little bit, washing them, rinsing them in hot water. So about 10, 20 seconds of how long it's been. All right, I'm gonna remove and then just drain and cool them so I can cut them up. Now the vegetables. Onion and scallions along with the garlic are the basics, but I like to use some colorful vegetables for a pop of color and, and flavors. I'm using chili peppers today. You can also use bell peppers, like red, orange, yellow, anything you want. And also carrot is really good too. So we're just gonna cut this up. So I just need quarter onion slices. So for chili peppers, hot peppers, you probably want to remove the seeds because they tend to be very spicy. Okay, we're gonna thinly slice these too. Okay, our fish cake is nice and cool, so we're gonna cut it. I just like to cut it into thin strips, maybe three quarter of an inch. Okay, ready. Okay, we're adding a couple of tablespoons of oil. We're gonna add aromatic vegetables first and a teaspoon of minced garlic. We're just gonna saute this until onion is softened and everything smells lovely. Yeah, so we basically infused our oil with aromatic vegetables. So now we're gonna add our fish cake. When you do things like this, it really helps to use both ends. Uh, you can use a two, two wooden spoons or spatula. I just like my chopsticks. So just stir fry, just 30, 40 seconds. You don't need to do for a long time. And fish cake really uh, sticks to the pan easily, so use non-stick pan always. And if uh, it browns, just reduce the heat a little bit. Okay, now it's ready for our seasonings. So while we're adding our seasonings, you can reduce the heat to low because you don't want to burn it. Okay, two tablespoons of soy sauce, like go around the pan. And I have one tablespoon mirror in here. Okay, one teaspoon sugar, but you can adjust, you can add more if you want. And we're gonna turn the heat back up to medium high. And we're just gonna stir fry again until all the sauce is absorbed by fish cake and become pretty dry. Looks great, smells good, doesn't it? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, I kept the uh, chili peppers because I didn't want it, them to lose their color too much. So now stir fry until the chili peppers are nicely softened. Okay, all I need to this right now is pinch of pepper and some sesame seeds. All done guys, how easy was that?
Okay, so for the spicy version, I'm using different shapes of amok. Some of these are very thick, so let me slice them up so that the sauce can penetrate better. For this one, this one is extra long, so I'm gonna cut this into three pieces and then thin strips. Okay, for this round one, I'm just gonna slice them up like that. Okay, uh, these are about eight ounces too. Okay guys, everything up to this point was exactly the same as the mild version. I'm just adding a tablespoon and adjust to your taste of gochugaru to make the dish spicy. There you have it guys, it's deliciously salty, slightly sweet, chewy yet tender amuk goes really well with your bowl of rice. I hope this becomes a staple in your home. Thanks for watching, see you next time. Stay tuned for more recipes from Korean Hapsa. Until next time, 안녕히 계세요.